The Boeing 777X was expected to be the shining star and the future of modern aviation, a revolutionary aircraft that promised to redefine the standard for wide-body air travel. For this reason, industry giants eagerly placed orders, anticipating a game-changing addition to their fleets. However, over time, the dream of the 7X unraveled into a series of catastrophic setbacks, delays, and mounting concerns. Why it happens? How will Boeing do to salvage the situation? Let's dive in. Why did a project as promising as the Boeing 7X fall into an unimaginable failure? Few products have ever generated the excitement and fierce anticipation that this jet did, heralded as a technological marvel, the largest and most efficient twin-engine jet in the world. With the ambition to revolutionize long-haul travel, the Boeing 777X was not just an aircraft. It symbolized innovation and Boeing's pioneering spirit in the aerospace industry. As dreams of soaring high in the skies were nurtured, a crucial question arose. What challenges hindered this dream from becoming a reality? The first and most important issue is the GE9X engine, developed specifically for the 7X by General Electric. This engine was set to be the largest and most powerful commercial jet engine ever built, providing unprecedented thrust and efficiency. Passenger experience was also enhanced by drawing insights from the renowned 787 Dreamliner. The 7X was designed with larger windows, improved cabin pressure, and higher humidity levels to offer superior comfort on long flights. However, it is not just a new aircraft, it symbolizes Boeing's long-term vision for the future of commercial aviation, particularly in long-haul travel. With a range of up to 8,745 nautical miles, the 777X can connect most cities around the globe without stopping creating opportunities for airlines to operate transcontinental routes more efficiently. Another its standout feature is its exceptional fuel efficiency, promising to make long-haul flights more economically viable and sustainable, potentially transforming global air travel patterns. The 777X program did not unfold as smoothly as Boeing had hoped. The initial difficulties began in 2018 when the GE-9X engine, developed by General Electric and considered a crucial component of this aircraft, encountered serious durability issues during testing. Designed to be the largest and most powerful commercial jet engine in the world, the GE-9X was a technological breakthrough aimed at enhancing performance and fuel efficiency. However, this technical failure forced Boeing to delay its first test flight, resulting in significant setbacks for the entire program. Despite these challenges, Boeing still maintained an optimistic outlook, continuously reassuring airlines and investors that the issues with the GE-9X engine were only temporary. However, this engine malfunction was just the beginning of a series of problems that the 777X program faced, including technical delays and rising development costs. Following the engine incident, the FAA and international regulatory agencies, having implemented stricter oversight procedures after the 737 MAX crisis, continued to exert pressure on Boeing, demanding more rigorous safety standards for the 7X certification process. In this context, addressing the technical challenges and ensuring compliance with safety standards is crucial for Boeing to bring the 7X to market. If successful, it could become a flagship aircraft in the aviation industry, reshaping how the world travels on long-haul routes. However, the path ahead for the 777X program is fraught with obstacles, as the manufacturer must navigate ongoing technical issues and shifts in the global market. The situation became even more critical in 2019. During a load testing exercise in September, the fuselage of the 7X failed when it reached the target stress level. This structural incident raised serious questions about the aircraft's design and Boeing's quality control processes. Can Boeing still regain trust and dominance with the 7X after so many setbacks? Please let us know in a comment. Second. The promises about the 7X paid attention to the giant airlines in the industry, but made them disappointed. Emirates, one of the standout airlines in the world with its headquarters in Dubai, made a strong impression when purchasing up to 115 new aircraft. Tim Clark, the CEO of Emirates, did not hesitate to consider it as the ideal inheritance for the legendary Airbus A380. Not only Emirates and Qatar, but Lufthansa show huge care with the order sequentially 74 and 20 777X with the aim modernization the fleet and enhancing the fuel efficiency on the long, busy routes. For Boeing, the 7X is not just an upgrade of the previously successful 7 Series, 
It is also a bold statement about the future of aviation. The design of this aircraft aims to bridge the gap between traditional large aircraft and smaller wide body models, offering impressive capacity and range while maintaining efficiency. Boeing's engineers have bravely pushed the boundaries of aviation technology, introducing numerous groundbreaking features. One notable improvement is the new folding wingtips, which are being used for the first time in commercial aviation. This innovation allows the 7X to access gates like smaller aircraft while still benefiting from a larger wingspan during flight to enhance fuel efficiency. However, a program that seemed so perfect has faced obstacles that have delayed the delivery of the 7X to airlines, continuously pushing back the anticipated delivery dates and affecting airlines' operational plans. Despite facing numerous challenges, Boeing continued to strive to keep the 7X program on track. However, the third obstacle emerged in 2020 with the outbreak of the COVID-19 pandemic, causing a profound crisis in the global aviation industry. In this context, the market for long-haul aircraft like it becomes more uncertain than ever. Customers who were once excited about the aircraft began to reevaluate their orders. Emirates, the largest airline to order the 7X, started negotiating to swap some orders for smaller aircraft. By 2021 and 2022, technical issues continued to escalate as regulators tightened the certification process for the 777X. Boeing was forced to make significant adjustments to the aircraft's systems and software to meet the new stringent requirements. These challenges not only delayed progress, but also placed immense pressure on the company's engineering and management teams. Fourth, Boeing's leadership style has had a significant impact on the failure of the 7X program. When faced with technical challenges and market pressures, the management opted for an approach focused on optimizing profits and costs, which led to the reduction of certain safety standards and quality control processes. One of the main reasons for its failure was the lack of transparency in communication between the management, the engineering team, and regulatory agencies. This shortfall created a credibility gap diminishing trust among customers and investors. Furthermore, the decision to expedite the development process and bring the product to market without allowing sufficient time for testing and resolving technical issues increased the risk of encountering problems during the testing phase. Additionally, Boeing's corporate culture has changed over time, particularly following its merger with McDonnell Douglas. This shift led to a focus on financial performance over quality, causing engineers and management to feel pressured to complete projects quickly rather than ensuring that the products fully met safety standards. This change contributed to the engine failures and other design issues that the 7X program faced. These failures of the 7X have raised questions about the role of leadership and corporate culture at Boeing. Do you agree that wise leadership is the most important? The 737 MAX crisis has cast a long shadow over all of Boeing's subsequent projects, including the 777X. First and foremost, the MAX crisis severely damaged its reputation. The company faced intense criticism from the public, customers, and regulatory authorities, leading to a global grounding of the 737 MAX. This loss of trust made airlines skeptical about the safety of Boeing's future products, including the new aircraft. Moreover, the MAX crisis delayed many of Boeing's certification and testing processes. Regulatory bodies, particularly the FAA, became more cautious in reviewing new aircraft, resulting in stricter regulations. This made it challenging for them to achieve certification for the 777X, further delaying the program. Finally, the MAX crisis forced the manufacturer to adjust its approach to management and product development. The company had to invest more in improving its quality and safety control processes, resulting in increased time and resource expenditure for the 777X program. This situation diminished Boeing's ability to compete with its rivals and created internal concerns about delivering the new aircraft program on schedule and to the established standards. With trust eroded and reputation damaged, the gap became increasingly difficult to bridge. The only way forward for Boeing at this time was not only to deliver a safe and efficient new aircraft, but also to demonstrate a stronger commitment to the company's core values. This might mean being willing to accept further delays if necessary, being transparent about the challenges they face, and collaborating closely with regulatory bodies and customers to ensure that the final product meets the highest standards of safety and performance. 
The failure of the 777X program has severely harmed Boeing in various ways, particularly in an increasingly competitive aviation landscape. First and foremost, the damage to its reputation is one of the most evident consequences. Customer and partner trust has significantly eroded, which makes airlines that once eagerly anticipated the 777X are now reconsidering their orders and seeking alternatives, resulting in a substantial blow to Boeing's standing in the industry.